Hi guys, welcome back to Steph's Vlogs. So I just spent like 30 minutes cleaning, maybe longer than that, like an hour, cleaning out my pantry, throwing away like my chip bags that I've saved with 10 Doritos left in it. I don't know why I save stuff like that. Same with pasta noodles, pasta, whatever. I always say noodles, even though I know noodles, the skinny long thing. But I did a good deep clean, got rid of some moldy cheese in my fridge, and everything looks great again. So I like to do a deep clean like that. Like honestly, every time I grocery shop, like get a lot of stuff. So maybe once a month, but let's just do a pantry and refrigerator haul tour. Okay, so in my kitchen, there is no pantry, which when my house was remodeled, I guess like there was a pantry right here and they like took it down and changed something. I don't really know exactly what it looked like before, but apparently there was a pantry, which I wish they would have kept the pantry. Um, Hershey also would like to say hi. Hi, Hershey. Hi. Okay, so yeah, you guys know me, I'm a huge foodie. So I'm like, why would they take out the pantry? So I have these two cabinets as pantry number one. So we will start up here at the top. We have all of my pastas. So just pasta box, pasta box. Um, some Annie's Mac, more pasta. Then over here I have all my ramen and mac and cheeses. There's some more mac and cheeses back there. And then down here I have some unopened bags of chips. I wish these stickers would stick because they are so cute. They're Ray Dunn stickers that I got from Home Goods, but they just will not stick. I'm like, I want to glue them on because <laughs> they're cute. Look, it's about to pop off again. Honestly, at this point, I might as well just take them off. So then here I have all of my pancake mixes, hot chocolate, popcorn, stuff like that. And then down here, I have a lot of chocolate. I know, you guys. I have a problem. I love chocolate. And then these bins are from Target. They are the Hearth and Hand brand. They are so cute. I love them. I have so many of these. You'll see a little bit, a little bit more of them later. And then I just have some flaming hot Cheeto balls and some crackers. And then these are all my opened bags of chips. Got some giant goldfish, rainbow goldfish. I'm not even like a huge goldfish fan. Um, <laughs> like goldfish, goldfish. I have some Oreos. My favorite chips are flaming hot Cheetos or salt and vinegar chips. And I don't even have any of those at the moment. Kroger is always sold out of Flaming Hot Cheetos. So I can never get Flaming Hot Cheetos. Which is honestly maybe a good thing because I will eat the whole bag with like a whole tub of cream cheese in one night. Like I will eat a lot of chips. Like the entire bag of chips. And then I will feel so guilty about it. I'm like why did I just eat the whole bag of chips? It's because I'm bored. It's dangerous when nighttime comes around. Because when it's like 11 o'clock and I'm on the couch watching something... I want to eat a snack like I can't just sit there and not eat anything like I need to be eating a snack and then when I start eating the snack I don't stop because I usually just grab the whole bag of chips but recently I've been trying to put stuff in bowls so that I don't eat like the whole bag of chips because after I eat the whole bag of chips I feel so gross and I'm mad at myself and like why did I just eat all those chips when I wasn't even hungry in the first place. So this is pantry number one, and let's head over to pantry number two over here. So this is kind of like the healthier cabinet, I guess. Um, we have lots of protein bars, lots of little like kind of bars. Again, in these cute containers, I just stacked them. I have some gum, I have some more protein bars. These are the yummiest chocolates ever from Trader Joe's. Little peanuts. They are so good. And they have like peanut butter inside with like also like crispy bits. So those are delicious. I have another bag too. Here I have all my oatmeals. I love this brand of oatmeal. It's so good. The cinnamon roll is delicious. And then also the maple brown sugar is good. The cinnamon roll is my favorite. And then I have this little container. Also... You can get like these containers, the clear ones, they're in my refrigerator too. 
um, in my link below. It's in my Amazon store. Um, here is rice, and I have some mashed potatoes, more rice, taco shells. I have some honey. See, these labels are sticking over here. Oh, not that one. <laughs> some chocolate chips, some little nuts. And then down here, I just have like tomato sauce, pasta sauces, and peanut butter. So like canned stuff. And then up here, I have crackers and some chocolates. Like there's some more stuff behind it. That's kind of like charcuterie board stuff back there. Um, and then right here are my nuts and seeds. Um, we have chia seeds and just kind of like salad toppers, cr croutons, I almost said croissants. And just like a bunch of nuts. So again, like charcuterie board stuff a little bit. So that is that. I just realized I have absolutely nothing up here. Oh, what is that? Okay, yeah, I could totally store stuff up there. I like forgot about it up there. When you're short, you can't reach. <laughs> And then here is my refrigerator. That's all organized, except the sides are kind of messy, but I don't really, I don't really care about that. So we'll start up here. I just have like this sports drink. I have these Starbucks glass drinks. I drank one of these today. I always have these on deck because they don't expire for a long time. So I just like buy them and keep them. I have some heavy cream and then behind here, I have lots of protein shakes. Um, I accidentally, I know it's like who accidentally does this. I accidentally was like signed up for a subscription. Also ignore the counter behind me, that's all trash. I just need to take out the trash first and then throw that in there. Um, I accidentally signed up for like a monthly subscription of groceries and it was for two months. So then I got two months of the exact same groceries. It kept reminding me, it was like, change your change your grocery cart or do you want the same subscription and i was just like i kept forgetting to do it and i got the same monthly subscription so that's why i have so many annie's mac and cheese boxes so many pasta boxes so many tomato sauce cans like it sent me the exact same stuff so that's why i have a lot of protein shakes and there's a ton more over here and i haven't even drank any of them yet um, but yeah, and then my mom got me these ones. I'm excited to try these. They actually have caffeine in it. I usually work out at night though. So next time I work out in the daytime, I know you guys, that is so annoying. I have looked everywhere on how to shut that off and it doesn't, you can't, you can't shut it off. Like it beeps after like 30 seconds, I swear, which is so annoying. Cause I'm one to leave the fridge open and like look, <laughs> but this is banana bread baked oats. Oh my gosh, it is so good. My apologies, banana bread overnight oats. Look how good. I'm so excited to eat that tomorrow. I have my Hello Fresh bags. Then over here, I have my veggies, avocados, lots of apples, and that's pretty much it, lemons. <laughs> I don't eat too many veggies. I need to get better at that, but I just don't really like them. It's like, I know, how old am I? <laughs> I mean, I like cucumbers, and I have carrots, and I have lettuce over there. Okay, let's just go in order. Then we have some cheese. My favorite cheese ball. It is so good with the almonds on it, so good. I have some French onion dip, hell of a good dip. And then this street corn dip from Aldi is so yummy. I got it the other day and I was like, wow, that is so good. So we have that and then there's also a roasted hummus back here, which this, yeah, this is also trash. That's been in there a while. <laughs> so then I have some boxed waters. These came from a hotel actually. I thought they were cute so I took them. And, and I have yet to drink them. They're kind of just decorations. They're so cute. Then I have some, oh gosh you guys. This is also definitely expired. These nacho cheeses have been in here a while. Sorry, this is like, a very messy refrigerator tour, but clean with me. <laughs> and then here, oh my gosh, I have so much cheese. So I got these, shut up. I am literally going to, oh, please someone help me if you have this refrigerator. Is it an LG? Where is even the logo? Where is the logo? LG, please. 
It's so annoying. So I bought these Gouda baby bells the other day. These are so good. They're habanero snack cheeses from Aldi. So yummy. And then I have protein, I have some yogurts, cinnamon bun, cinnamon bun, huh, that's hard to say. And then I really like this Too Good yogurt, super yummy, and only two grams of sugar. And then over here, this is my ice face roller ball. It feels nice on your face. And then we have some pudding and some ranch veggie dip cups for the carrots or cucumbers. Down below, I have my big old daddy tub of Duke's mayo. I know, so unnecessary. There's actually, ouch. There's actually a lot missing from it because I like put some in mason jars and my mom took some. But I know I need to make like potato salad or something with it because there's so much. Here I have some leftover soft tacos and leftover taco. So I decided to store it in the bento box, which I thought was such a good idea. So we have the meat with poblano peppers in here, tomato, onion, cilantro, and that's some cheese. So I just stored it in there. I think I'm gonna have that for dinner tonight. We have some lettuce, we have some eggs, we have some queso and salsa. I know that is still good to eat. We have some ground beef to go with my HelloFresh, cucumbers, carrots, and then in here, we have some jalapeno cream cheese, which this stuff is so good with wheat thins. Regular cheese, more cheese. Um, I got wonton wraps because I wanted to make cream cheese rangoons, but I haven't done that yet. And then over here I have lots of Buckeyes, some crescents, some biscuits, some butter, and lots of garlic sauce because you guys know my obsession with garlic. Down here I have more cheeses. I have some bologna. Ugh, I have an obsession with bologna right now. I think I only have like one day left to eat that, so shoot, I gotta eat that. <laughs> some pepperoni, some bunny-shaped cookies, and these, oh my, these lava cakes, you guys. They have chocolate ones and caramel-filled ones. You can get them at Aldi's. They're so good. You just microwave them. And then on the sides, I just have some water because I usually just drink water out of the sink, so this is just sink water, chilled. Um, some electrolytes, stuff like that. And then I have a ton of sauces. Like, I am not gonna go through all these, but I just have a ton of sauces and hot sauces. Lots of pickles, jalapenos, and there's some protein stuff up there. So, that is my refrigerator. We will go into the freezer, which I tried to organize this the best I could. It's just slightly messy. Uh, because there's so much stuff. But over here I have my ball ice, my cube ice, my ball ice is in the making. <laughs> and then I have a ton of bread and Bosco sticks. My mom makes homemade bread like every single day. So I am stocked on loaves of bread. Mm, homemade bagel bread, the recipe for this. Oh wait, no, that's sourdough, okay. Well, the homemade recipe for bagel bread is on Steph's meals. But that's a little complicated to make, but my mom filmed herself making it and I added a voiceover to it. So if you wanna try and make it. And then I have some sausage. This company sent me all this bread. So I just have bread and pasta everywhere, but this is from Aldi, this is good. They had a mint one too, but I got the cookie dough one. I ate like all the cookie doughs out of it the other day. <laughs> and then these I really like as well. They're little wild blueberries, strawberries, and banana bites with yogurt balls. They kind of look like Dippin' Dots. So good, such a good snack. I also love these Yes So chocolate chip cookie dough Greek yogurt bars. They taste like ice cream. They are so good and the cookie dough in them, amazing. And then down here underneath all of this, it's like meals. So I just have like chicken, salmon, mac and cheese bites. So yeah, I can barely shut my freezer. I just went through it and I got rid of like as much as I could. So that is that. And I have this pumpkin cookie dough. Let me see when this expires. It might still be good. November of 2021, no, oh my gosh. Hope you guys enjoyed my little pantry tour. This is like the really organized and pretty one. I feel like this looks so good. Thanks for watching, bye guys.